And as you were saying before, like the mythology, these figures are really close to us because it's universal. But for you, it was hard to bring this story nowadays, you know, after a pandemic or, you know. Trying to get inside the mind of the people when the story takes place and present it without judgment. But like, you know, I don't live in a vacuum. And so things come out. You know, and I think that the violence in this movie, there's been tons of journalists who've been, you know, talking with me about about the war. And obviously it is, uh, you know, really frightening to see that, like, something I wrote years ago, Act Two is set in ancient Ukraine. <clears throat> so, you know, it needs to work. I don't, I don't want, I don't, my, my intention is not to, 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 to make it work for a modern audience, but if it doesn't, then I've failed. Like, like the, all the Vikings are dead. They can't enjoy this movie. He can't process that. It's too much. Yeah. And Amlet is like torment by his past, you know? Watching yourself hanging from a ceiling covered half in blood and half naked didn't actually, you know, hunted the Eric from true blood uh, past. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, there are definitely some similarities there. Um, in a way, the idea, not, well, in a, the idea, the, 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 the very embryo that later became the Northman was born um, on the set of True Blood. We we shot um, some some flashbacks to when my Eric Northman, my character, also the name, his name uh, yeah. is Eric Northman, um, to when he was a Viking, when he was a human before he was turned uh, mm -hmm. into a Viking, uh, to a to a vampire, um, and those scenes were so much fun. It was just a couple of scenes of like Eric, they built up like this long house on the sound stage in Hollywood, um, and we shot it in Swedish, with, like the Viking family. And um, that's kind of when I started thinking, they were so much fun to shoot. And I started thinking, what a dream it would be to one day make uh, a whole movie about a Viking. And then. Uh, <laughs> and here we are. 